Hey Loomers, today I'm going to share with you my charm collection. This collection isn't just for the sake of having a collection, but I'm actually going to be using these charms in bracelets. I've roughly gone over these charms right here on the left in my storage 2017 collection video. So let's start off with these first. This is my container. Just a regular plastic container. In here I have a paper clip that is twisted in a way that is different from its original form. An anchor that has, it looks like a serpent at first, but it's actually just a rope that is wrapped around it. Two sailboats. And sadly, as you can see, only one of them has that hole so you can put your band through. Don't know how to use this other one. I have this lone charm here. It's supposed to be a chain of these. I don't know where the rest are. I mean, I'm sure I have it in my room. I just separated this one because you can from the rest. By the way, all these charms are just from Walmart. Next, I have ship's wheel. I forget what they're called. Ship's wheel or ship's steering wheel. I have these anchors again, but this time they're kind of in frames, I guess you could say. Then I have the Sloan bead. I think I threw the rest away because I couldn't fit any bands through that hole right there. It's very tiny. That's basically just colors. And we have a white band. I don't know if it's glow in the dark or if it's just a regular white band. Then I have two zippers. I don't know why I have two zippers in here. Maybe I thought it would be cool to add them to some bracelet. Maybe. I have a paper clip that hasn't been bent. Oh, so that's where it was. The sailboat that was missing the part, this is where it is. Maybe I could glue it together still. Right here, it's supposed to be like that so I could put a band through. Another one of those anchors. And last but not least, a black pony bead that's not connected, it's open. Moving on to this one. This blue thing is actually a compartment of an old jewelry box. Before I start naming these charms right here, this right here, don't mind it. It's just, you see this like yellow spongy thing right here? This is glue. There used to be a thin sheet of spongy material that used to cover this here, so. Oh, another thing before we get into this, I've taken some of my jewelry apart. Some of them are from friends, some of them are birthday gifts. If you notice your present in here and it's in my salvage jewelry, hopefully you don't mind me taking apart all the pieces. First, I have this used to be a necklace, has a big heart charm. How you would close it, there's this kind of rod right here, um, I don't know. Then you would just put it through the hole and pull it again and it's already locked. See, like that. If you're a friend and you're watching this that you don't mind if I take your present apart, Hopefully you don't mind, hopefully you understand. So yeah, I have this beautiful blue heart. It still has that ring on it. So I can put a band through it and I can bling a bracelet or a necklace. Golden button. And I've already inserted two bands through there. And then um, I think this used to be like part of, this came with a top I think that I bought like a long time ago basically like a chain like that. I'm not sure, this is not a cup chain, right? I'm not these plastic clear hearts. Then I have miscellaneous beads here. I've got a bit of everything. I have these silver beads right here. I have quite a bunch of those. I'm not going to take everything out because then I'll have to put everything back in. Then I have these longer, more detailed jewelry pieces, but they're not beads, like these are beads. I have these, another cylindrical 
looking ones that are more plain. They're obviously the same shape as these, but they're more plain. And this is just a charm bracelet that for some reason I found in there too, but I do not want to take this apart. So that is basically it, guys. Again, most of these bracelets here are gifts from other people and hopefully they don't mind that I'm taking apart their presents. If you want to bling your bracelets, you can find some really cheap ones at Walmart. You can go to Michael's, they sell some beads there too, or jewelry pieces, cup chains, and all that jazz. Alright, thanks for watching guys. Bye!